This is Vinny Stone, the new electric football coach for the Tennessee Volunteers. He has no experience coaching electric football. He used to be a librarian. That means, all his knowledge about football came from books. Vinny admits he has trouble remembering his players' names. Like, T. Various Ness, King, Ty Royal Smoochie Wallace, D. Squarius Green, Jr., Desiah T. Billings Clyde, Leo Maxwell Gilliams, Devoin Shower Handle, Hingle McCringleberry, Oz Amitaz Buck Shank, D. Glester Hard Dunk, N. Token White. I has to be honest with you. I don't have any knowledge about football. Vinny suffered a massive stroke four years ago. He lost feeling in his right hand and lost the ability to count. That led to massive penalties. Illegal formation. Illegal formation. Too many men on the field. Too many men on the field. Vinny's stroke impacted his ability to speak. Calling plays and teaching his players is difficult. Yes, and you can't bet that there's this. Two by two. Two by two. Guys, it is a simple game. You catch the ball. You pass the ball, you kick the ball, and a tackle from body. Vinny arrived at the Apex Electric Football Tournament in March 2023. The tournament brings the best coaches in the entire hobby. In all, 35 coaches will compete for the Apex Championship. Despite trying his best, Vinny was beaten by Ohio State by 86, Delaware State by 69, USC Community College by 72, Michigan by 103, and only by 7 by Nebraska. Vinny only has half a brain, but somehow he still competes. I don't know how, but... And still do it somehow. I was playing against Vinny. He scored uh, 62 points before halftime. Vinny had 124 negative yards. I don't even know if that's possible. Sometimes my team is, um, what's the word? Um, dumbasses. After a while, my team gets it, you know? First down, Tennessee. First down, Tennessee. First down, Tennessee. On the final play of the tournament, Tennessee has a chance to score a touchdown. Vinny called his favorite play. B-17 side door open. Unfortunately, the play resulted in a sack. Mushy Wallace sustained a career-threatening injury. Well, that's life. You have to keep on keeping on. <laughs>